Kemper Road tank is located on East Kemper Road, which is right near the intersection of 71 and I-275. You can kind of see it from I-275 if you know where to look. It serves our Brecon service area. It's connected to our Brecon service area, which is areas like Blue Ash, Kenwood, and Montgomery, kind of the northeast side of the city. It's helping provide redundancy in that area. This tank will sit next to our Brecon tank. It's just a few miles down the road. So we do get additional storage in that area. Also with Lebanon coming online, the new customers, this will help provide uh, water to the Lebanon pump station to feed that service area. Uh, aside from being the biggest elevated tank that we have, it stores 3 million gallons of water. It's the first composite tank that we have. And a composite tank just means that the pedestal is made of one material, concrete, and the bowl is made out of another, steel. With the size of this tank, it made sense to go with a composite. There were a couple other options, but composite was the most economical. We actually bid it against a fluted tank, which is real similar to a composite, with the exception that the bottom is steel instead of concrete, and it came out that the concrete price was a little bit cheaper. In order to jack the bowl up, they had to weld 72 lugs on the inside of the bowl. And they took 72 hydraulic jacks on the top of the pedestal and dropped wire down from the hydraulic jack down to the lugs. So they were able to run a couple pumps and pull it up one foot at a time. After each foot, they had to reset, they locked the cable down and then reset all of the hydraulic jacks and then let it pump up to the next foot, so literally one foot at a time for the 64 feet that it had to climb. Weighs about 350 tons, so it's just real heavy, and with 72 separate jacks working, just takes some time to, to pull that much weight. It's definitely interesting. You don't see it every day, and uh, with the companies that perform this work, there's only a few of them in, in the U.S. that do it. Each one of them has a, def a different system. So. To be able to see Caldwell's system is interesting. I'm sure the other ones would be unique and different and in their own way.